Well, hello there, welcome back to Avatobi's Let's Play of Folktale, an early access game. I am currently on episode 2, and I'm currently doing the tutorial, and so far this has been pretty neat. I remember there was fighting involved in the original building completed. Uh, before this change, and hopefully there's going to be fighting in it. Train a farmer. I click on this, and train a farmer. Busy, busy, busy. While well, surely a grand feat of architecture and construction, a windmill without wheat fields was about as useful as a grave robber at a crematorium. <laughs> Because everyone's burned so he can't rob the grave, <laughs> seriously. Bob said about organising his underlings to construct several wheat fields. Without being prompt, pro pro woodies, prompted, Bob built the fields close to the windmill, trying to do, otherwise it would be folly, as the lazy farmers would simply turn a blind eye rather than walk all that way. Build free farm yields, how do I build them? Uh, oh, does it just literally appear? Windmill, weaver, farmer field. Ah, oh, literally, yes. Mm. Mm. I gotta build three. Cha -ching. Can I vouch shift? I'm gonna build more. Let me try this time. Cha -ching. A building has nope. been constructed. I'll do, three. Probably should train a few more farmers. Maybe I should do four. All right, dear. Okay. Okay. It's my there. Construction Maybe I should build four completed. Four now. And build that. Well, there. Building completed. Okay. We didn't just magically appear. It would take time to grow, and unless Bob expected the villagers to eat flour, which quite frankly sounded revolting, there was just enough time to build a bakery. Ah, bake at least one bread. I need to build a bakery. Ah, bakery, bakery. Construction completed. Ah, uh, bakery, bakery. What a bakery look like? Herbalist, monster, locksmith, stone cutters, storehouse. Oh well. Cottage, hunting, fishing, farmers, cottage, herb. Okay, I must be under this. So there's military. How do I build a bakery? Advanced. Marketplace. Tailor. Butchery. Bakery! Hmm, let me zoom out. I think it's easier to work out where you can put it when you zoom down, isn't it? I'll make a little... Because I can be here. Cha-ching! I actually need some more cottages to get more villagers. I love cottages. Mm, there we go. And I also build another cottage. Cottage, 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 cottage. Maybe this makes me some cottage pals. That would be nice. There. It's actually going to be up to 20, shouldn't it? Hmm. So far, I like this. What they've done to it. Oh, that's what I said. I didn't do it. I was going to, um, after the episode 2, I was going to turn the game off and see like, what the graphics were like. I forgot to turn it off. I just went straight to episode 2. Sorry, I'll do that next episode if I remember. <laughs> See the graphics improve because remember last time I put them higher and it said it won't do it until I turn the game off and on. Uh, I kind of want to do a tutorial and I'll probably do it. Ooh, what's this? Train a baker. What's this flashing? What's wrong? What's wrong, people? Why are you upset? So Gregory stumbled across a site that had recently been had seen battle. Who's Sir Gregory? Several dead. Lay besiege a uh, ransack wagon. Whoever the good people were, they put up a fight and paid the price. Perhaps they might be clues nearby for Bob. Building completed. Oh, sugar food. So we need to get food fast. Maybe I shouldn't have gone with the extra buildings. Build a bakery, train a baker. Maybe that's why, because I need the baker. Trying to make pleasure. 
Thank you, come in. Training this person will leave you without any peasants. A building has been constructed. Oi, whatever. Okay, bake some bread. How to bake some bread? Open building dialogue. Rolling pin. Okay, I need that peasant, don't I? Uh, how to bake bread? Search for clues. Are you just going to bake it automatically for me, or what? Yep. Are you baking for me? Bakers will collect flour and water and bake it into bread. Ah, yeah. With more than just berries to eat, village happiness would soon be on the rise. Although we have more food too. Bob took a moment of quiet compilation to appreciate all that he had achieved. Having massive construction and economy, Bob felt that the only one desired to head out and search for adventure. With precise timing, uh, as if he'd been listening to the story unfold all this time, the hero said Gregory wandered into town. I can remember you're huge. Submitting entirely to Bob's will, Sir Gregory possessed special abilities that would appear around his portrait in the bottom left of the screen. Okay, it's down here, I guess. Many of Sir Gregory's abilities would become useful in combat when they would be ta be targeted at Eminus. Experimenting with Sir Gregory's visibility, Bob discovered that some abilities could be used at any time. Oh, for, oh no! Why you would want iron skin during peaceful time is beyond me. Imagine the weight of carrying that around while you did the grocery shopping. Seriously. Ah, hero following. Select it. So where's these abilities of his? Oh, it's probably these. Or is it this? Iron skin. There we goes. Oh yeah. Beauty iron. Power slam. Hmm. Shield bash. Hmm, interesting. Whatever that is. Oh. Taunt. Oh, he's got evil eyes. Look at the devil. Say something about anyone's mother, which causes Emily to attack his character for 10 seconds. Bash opponents with a crushing blow that stuns them, deals 25 physical damage to all Emily within 13 units. Off front of the character. Stamps opponents into the ground, dealing 50 physical damage to all Emily within 10 units. Transform your skin to be as hard as iron, which increases armor. Oh, that's another one that was like a funny one. Because I, I read that first, I thought these would be funny. Oh well. I digress. Sir Gregory would head off over the bridge in search of unknown in the direction of the quest marker that had thoughtfully been added to the minimap. Ready for battle! Ready for battle from this way. Double time! Double time. Maybe I've got it a bit too loud. Um, secondary. Primary. Nothing to see here. A bit better. I guess he Arm some nuts. yourselves! Hmm, interesting. Ooh! Teeth, ne teeth necklace, tower shield, and sword. Loot all! Loot all! The teeth necklace uh, led Bob to just one conclusion. Cablots. Oh, cobblots. Cobblots, whatever you say. A rustle in the bushes. Startled Bob, the scavenging party had come back for the last of the supplies. It was time to fight! <laughs> Okay, is this real time or is a pause function or what? And so to battle. Okay, another line I'm hitting taunt for. Power slam. Bob's doing it. He's doing it. Good, Bobby. You level beautiful. Bob was victorious. Sir Gregory had grown in power and could now level up. With Sir Gregory selected, Bob left. Clicked on the the bag icon and the character portrait. We'll press C to open the character. Can I pick this stuff up first? Tis an honor. I want this first. Oh, you're in my way. Fudge. Okay, let me loot first. Loody loody. Loody loody. Oh, not on him. How like standing firm. Can I open any of this? Oh, look at the dead guy. Ah. He is pretty awesome. Okay, so this is it, no, no. Bob pureed Sir Gravis' stats, or pure V, whether, with great interest, gaining a level had awarded Sir Gregory an ability point that could now be spent. If Bob wanted to dig deeper, hovering the mouse pointer over the stat icon would show a tooltip full of useful information. So stuff like that. Hmm, play of armor. Neat. How do I equip Sir Gregory with the cool loot I just found? Pondered Bob. Soon he was discovered that pressing the bag icon on the toolbar 
top ball, sorry, or pressing the I would open the master victory. So I. Ah, neat. Dragging items from the Master Imagery on, onto Sir Gregory's character sheet, Bob gave his hero some new gear. Right clicking on a piece of gear in the Master Imagery would achieve the same result. So, I don't even saw it. Oh, he does. But I can't see because of this. With bloodlust that required to satisfy it and the need for rightful retribution, Bob led Sir Gregory up the hill in the hope of finding the Cobalt's main camp. I'll do it in a minute. I want to check his swords out. Mm. Yeah, I need that open. So this one is 20 physical fire strength. I gave him 20. Yeah, so it's better. So currently equipped, used by 46 for the same. Um. He's bread, he's got wood. Oh, this isn't the quest things in the way, I can't. Hmm, that's a little annoying. Oh, maybe. Aha, that works. That works. Usable by City Watch, okay, 16, 13, so this is not as good. Okay, interesting. What does this one do? The Sangi, oh. So it's the same thing to bring this up, is it? Okay. Whatever. <clears throat> so he's strength. Agility, vitality. Uh, vitality. In terms of characters' health points and health recovery rate. Ag agile characters have a better chance of evading attacks and landing criticals. Strength determines attack rating for melee characters. Mind determines the characters' power points and contribute to the caster's attack. So I guess, give him a strength, and some vitality, vitality, uh, vit vitality, sorry. Oh, I only have the one. Hmm, yeah. Nah, I do, this, yeah, the health, because he's only one guy to stay alive longer. No way to confirm it. Oh, just turn it off, confirms it. So, is it C to bring that up? Yeah, C. Okay, so it's waiting to talk to them. So they want me to go up here. Quick march! Well, my village is growing because they don't seem to be. What's wrong? Okay, they need more food. How do you just find the regular. er. Uh, non assigned villagers? Hmm. What are you? You're a baker. Let me take one of you guys. Farmer work to be done. Let's get to work. Okay. I don't want you to be a uh, thing anymore. I want you to get berries. Oh, you can't. Okay. Okay. Get back to farming. Oh, here. Really? Yes, I want you to get some food. Real man has a beard. I also got to keep enough getting food for him. Hopefully, that will increase for us now. So basically, if they're something like a farmer, they can't leave me farming. Is. Oh, I can. Demo. Right away. All right, dear. Are these unlimit unlimited, these berries? Because they don't seem to have a set. So, is that better now? Minus one. Uh, hopefully, they'll get better at doing this now. Get back to Sir Gregory, shall we? Ready to serve! So he wants me to go up here. As you command. Hmm. Some couple ups. To victory. Come on. Oh, this one. That's a victory. 
Oh, fudge. Come on, die. Awaiting your command! Around. Having killed the last of the Coblots, it became apparent that the story was positively willing Bob to enter the mine. Only heroes could enter a dungeon, so Bob selected Sir Gregory and right clicked the main entrance. I want to get my loot first. Loody loody. Okay. Enter the mine. Okay, you know what? I'm going to enter it next episode. So, like, subscribe, and good stuff, and we'll continue with the. You know. The tutorial. So that's pretty neat, even for a tutorial, I have to say. Oh, well, I'll do a sneak peek. Let enter now. Why not? Screw it. Let enter. See what's inside this. Oh, and it's actually loading up another screen. Oh, neat. Hmm. Cool. Okay, so I'll see you next time and we'll see what's in here. And I'll read what it says at the bottom. Bye for now, people. Bye-bye.